Hi guys and welcome to Simply Scuba. Now if you have poor eyesight then you need prescription lenses fitted into your mask. In this video I'm going to show you how to fit prescription mask lenses into your Tusa Seos mask. Let's take a closer look. Okay, so first off, it's much, much safer if you use a Tusa mask tool. Uh, so this is basically a plastic flathead screwdriver because a, uh, a traditional metal one is gonna scratch and, uh, and be quite damaging to your mask. So it's much, much safer if you use one of these. So to get the lenses out of your Tusa Seos mask, the first thing you have to do is peel back this section of the skirt and underneath that, you'll see a little clip in there. What you need to do is you need to lift that up and then that will push that little clip over the, um, the bridge of the nose and then that comes out. So that's just a little spacer that holds the internal frame of the mask in position. Put that to one side, keep hold of that and then keep going back from where you were and you're going to push the back of this internal frame, so this clear section, push that out of the mask. That lifts it away and then depending on how strong your fingers are, you can just pull sideways this internal frame and pull it out of position. If it's a little bit stiff, you can use the mask tool just to get in the side and just um, peel that out around either side of the nose and then that section of the frame comes out. The lenses aren't held into position by anything other than pressure, so you can just pull them out and then replace them with your prescription lenses. Now the, uh, the Seos has uh, bisymmetrical lenses, so it's the same shape on either side, but, um, but the prescription lens is always on the inside, so the flat side of the lens is always facing outwards. Another useful tip is that you can always read Tusa from the front of the lens. Now I'm just going to replace the, uh, the lenses back into this mask, but obviously you change for your lenses. What you want to do is you want to seat it inside the seal, make sure it's nice and neat, and then you just replace that internal frame, get the central section over the nose in position, and then you're just going to push these little clips back into position and try and do it symmetrically as you go round, otherwise you'll struggle to get the final clips in. Down at the bottom, there's a little uh, clip on the other side, do that up, either side of the mask, get that in position, and then up here at the top. And then a handy part of that uh, lens tool is that the space of the main shaft just fits in the center and that just adds that space so the spacer can get put back into position. So take that out and then the spacer, the wider part goes at the top, push that into position and your mask is ready to go. Just double check all the way around, make sure there are no gaps, put it up to your face, do the usual sniff test, make sure there aren't any leaks and you're ready to go diving. So that's how you fit prescription lenses into the Tusa Seos mask. Each of these bits are all available at our website simplyscuba.com. Thanks for watching and safe diving.